So hello friends. This question is from the test series number five, and the subject of network and topic name is number network solution methodologies. In the problem, we need to find the voltage drop across the resistance R3. Okay, we need to find the voltage drop across the resistance R3, and in the circuit. Already mentioned the three loop current I1, I2, and I3. This is the simple KVL based question. Okay, simply apply the KVL in each and every mess. Apply KVL in each mess. Find the three equations and solve it. So if I may apply the KVL in first mess, this will be equal to the 300 I1 plus 100 I2 plus 150 I3 is equal to zero. Equation number one. Second is 100 I1 plus 650 I2 minus 300 I3 is equal to zero. Equation number two. Okay. Third is minus 150 I1 plus 300 I2 minus 450 I3 is equal to zero. Equation number three. So just solve these three equations. So we'll get the value of I1 as minus 93.793 milliampere. Okay, then you will get the I2 as I2 as 77.241 milliampere. You will get the I3 has 136.092 milliampere. So just find out the IR3. You can see that IR IR in relation R3 is basically a middle resistance of loop one and loop two. So the current across R R3 will be basically May I1 minus I2 because I1 and I2 both are in opposite direction. So current across the R3 will be I1 minus I2. So my I R3 will be I1 minus I2, which is 93.793 minus 71.24 or 16.522 milliampere I R3. So my V R3 will be equal to the I R3 into 100, which is the magnitude of resistance. It will be equal to the 1.6552 volt. My VR3 will be 1.6552 volt. My current option is option B. Option B is my answer. Thank you.